A plea from the family of a woman gunned down inside a University City business. Fox News' Kelly Hoskins talked with the victim's family who begged for the killer to come forward. 43-year-old Keisha Powell was the daughter of a prominent community leader and former Northwoods Alderman Thornton Ballard. Ballard described his daughter as a remarkable human being who throughout her life helped those in need. She was the type of individual that if, if she had a last dollar and if it would help you along the way, she would, she would extend it to you. You know, and she said, you know, uh, I'd rather give it to you than for me to hold on to it. In fact, Powell was currently an operations manager for Home Instead Senior Care, a company that provides in-home health care. She was a loving mother of two and helped raise her younger brother and sister after her mother's death and her stepfather was no longer in the picture. She had six kids that she was raising in her home. She made sure that they was well fed. No one was going to give it to her, so she would get out as far as doing it herself. Her body was found Tuesday morning in an office complex in the 8100 block of Del Mar Boulevard in University City. Police say a worker discovered her dead around 9 a.m. and called police. And as the investigation continues here at the University City Police Department, Powell's father says that she was well liked by everyone and anything she touched would turn to gold. He says that her life was cut short too soon and she will be missed. Ballard wants the person responsible to come forward. I would ask that individual to turn himself in, ask the Lord for forgiveness, do the right thing. In University City, Kelly Hoskins, Fox 2 News. Police think Powell knew her killer. They are looking for a dark blue 2014 Dodge Avenger with a Missouri license plate of YG5X8G. Police want to question the person who was in that car.